Hello academics, today's video is going to be about the food web. If you know what a food chain is, then you should probably know what a food web is. You see, a food web is basically the relationships of the animals in different food chains in the same ecosystem. So as I've said in all of the other videos, sit back, relax, and enjoy the video. The grass gets its energy from the sun, and the rabbit gets its energy from the grass, and the owl gets its energy from the rabbit. These are the basics of what will be called a food chain. But wolverines can eat rabbits, just like how owls can. Owls can eat chameleons. Chameleons can eat spiders and ants. Ants can eat slugs. Ants and slugs can eat plants. Snakes eat rabbits, are preyed on by wolverines and owls. And they eat chameleons. A food web. The relationships of different food chains in ecosystems and biomes represented by a chart of different intertwining food chains. Producers are mainly plants. They're an organism in a food chain that provides for prey consumers in the food chain so that when predatory consumers eat the prey, they'll gain that energy too. Isn't that a fun fact to know? Consumers are organisms in the food chain that eat, pretty much. Lowest ones in the chain eat producers. Ones that hunt and are hunted eat some consumers, and apex predatory consumers eat all consumers below. Big composers like maggots, flies, some butterflies, fungi, slugs, and other disturbingly cool things eat away at waste, cleansing the planet. Butterflies because some are the trivorous, meaning they eat stool and waste. Pollinators are organisms that suck on flowers to get nectar, spreading seeds in the process. This helps the producers to populate, helping all parts of the food chains alike. Mosquitoes are the only pollinators that do not deserve love. A population is the amount of animals or humans in a whole. For example, approximately 8 billion humans walk the face of the earth as of late 2022 and 2023. Say the population of grass was zero, with nothing to eat, well, the rabbit will starve and causing it to be malnourished. And the predators will have nothing to eat, causing them to die. Even the strongest apex predators will die. Alright, let's see what you've learned. What is the primary source of energy in most food chains slash webs? G, solar energy. H, producers. I, fruits. J, meat. K, decomposers. L, starfish. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 1 half. If you guessed G, you were correct. Want to know a fun fact? A scientist that studies ecosystems is called an ecologist. According to his data, you want to subscribe? So go and do it now.